Hello friends, welcome to another class. Today our subject is on basic science and our topic, pollution. Our last class was on structures and remember, a structure is a building or a framework, okay? And we have the natural made structure and the human made structure. Now natural made structures are those ones made by nature, while the human made structures are those ones made by man. Okay, now let's focus on our topic for today. Pollution is the process of making land, water, and air dirty and not suitable for use. So when you make your land, water, or air dirty, it simply means you have polluted your environment. Now we'll have some types of pollution, land pollution, water pollution, air pollution, and noise pollution. Remember, when you make your land, water, or air dirty, it simply means you have polluted your environment. Now, today we'll focus on land pollution. Now, land pollution simply means contaminating your land, making land not suitable for use, okay? Now, we have some causes of land pollution and ways to avoid land pollution which i call prevention now land pollution can be caused by oil spillage from broken oil pipelines now careless dumping of human and industrial waste on land what do i mean by oil spillage oil from industries oil from industries can make your land not suitable for use if you spill oil on your land, you cannot plant on that land. Good crops will not grow on that land. Now, when you dump refuse from your home on land, it also makes it not suitable for use. It spoils and kills the nutrients on that land. Now, industrial waste on land, too, also has a way of contaminating your land. So if you pour waste from industries, factories, okay, waste from factories and industries can also spoil or contaminate your land, thereby making it not suitable for use, most especially when it comes to planting of crops. So we have some preventions here. Number one says people should be educated on the dangers of land pollution. Now, if you soil your land or you contaminate your land, you cannot plant crops on that land and it simply means there will not be food in that environment. So, if you cannot plant, then you cannot eat. So, it's better you do not contaminate your land. So, more people should be educated on how to keep away from land pollution. Now, number two say, modern toilet facilities should be used. People are not meant to defecate on land. You are to use your WC, okay? Use your toilet facility properly. You don't go and defecate on land. It's not hygienic. Number three says, laws should be made against land pollution. Laws should be made against land pollution. So if the government should place a law and say anyone caught contaminating land should be arrested, that is the law to avoid land pollution. So remember, pollution is the process of making land, water, and earth dirty and not suitable for you. So if you make your environment not suitable for use, it simply means you have polluted your environment. And also remember that our types are land pollution, water pollution, air pollution, and noise pollution. Beautiful. I'm sure you have learned something today. Now you have your whole package there. It says, list three causes of land pollution and ways to prevent them. So you list for me three causes of land pollution and the ways to prevent them. Beautiful. Now take good care of yourself and always remember that I, Mrs. Ebu Barifit, I love you so much. So take care of yourself. Bye-bye.